Well, the countdown continues for the 77th annual Montana East-West Shrine football game this weekend. And the man leading the Western All-Stars here in Butte is Florence Carlton's Pat Duchesne, who led the team for seven seasons, but the past three led them to state titles. The first ever Class B program to three-peat. And for him and the Florence representatives, this is one special final game together. Florence has had a nice pipeline to the Shrine game over the last few years because of the program's success. And this year's crop of graduates are soaking up having completed the three-peat. Looking back on it now, it just like it's crazy it's all over. But at the same time, we like we got three, and it was just awesome to, you know, sit back and watch that that hard work actually did pay off. Teamwork and then just our connections with our coaches were amazing. Our coaches were awesome. They pushed us every day to be better. You know, they're like our dads out there, they're amazing. A big part of that run was because of head coach Pat Duchesne, who took over the program seven seasons ago and slowly, year by year, built Florence into a powerhouse in Class B. It's been more about thinking about all the kids that have came through, all the good kids that have come through that program, their success stories. The reflection is a lot about the players and just how they really truly bought into a culture that was, you know, unknown. Seven years ago, they didn't know it. You're not going to change it right away. So those guys, those guys were the first hand in it. Duchesne stepped down after the season was over, and assistant coach Adam Goodnight will take over the reins of the program. And Duchesne's impact was felt strongly by those he coached and will get to coach one more time in the Shrine game. He bring a fantastic culture to Florence, and he really was one of the big reasons we were successful. He held every single one of us accountable from freshman to senior. He did a lot for the program. He raised a lot of money. He did a lot of good stuff for the coaching staff, bring a lot of good people in when we needed people. He's just a fantastic guy, and he'll do anything for any single one of us on that team. So collectively, Duchesne and his former Falcon players will coach and play in one final high school game this weekend before going separate ways as they get to represent the community of Florence, play for the Shrine's bigger cause, and bask in the successes they helped build in the program over the years. It's the culture, it's the kids, seeing the kids do the right things, you know, off the field, in the classroom, in the school, taking care of each other when somebody's down. I don't think it's about the rings or the championships, I think it's about these kids growing into phenomenal young men. Reporting in Butte, Kyle Hansen, MTN Sports.